Hi, my name is Robert Paxton, and I've been asked to answer a few questions that have been sent in to the NSSA. And there. So let's go to another question. Uh, barrel length. What's, uh, how to decide on which barrel length to choose? In skeet, the targets are very close to us, and so barrel length doesn't have near as much effect, in my opinion, as it does in longer range games in skeet and sporting. So when you talk about the different brands of guns, many things um, work into deciding what that gun's going to feel like and point like, the dynamics of that gun, other than barrel length. As an example, a heavier gun with 28-inch barrels will move slower and be a slower gun than a lighter gun with 30-inch barrels. So you really have to decide which brand you're going to use. And then for me, the barrel length, the, the only difference that a skeet shooter will see it, it, among different barrel lengths is the longer ones will be a heavier in the same brand. And that's really it. I don't think there's anything to sighting plane at the very short distances that we shoot skeet targets. You know, our longest shot is 21 yards and our average shot's 15 or 16 yards. Those targets are right on top of us. So you go with the barrel length you're comfortable with, uh, but take, in, take into account the entire package, the dynamics of the gun. Um, if someone walks into my shop and I put a gun in their hand and they are playing with it and they're mounting it and they're looking at it and then I ask them the question, how long are the barrels on that gun? You know what, they need a tape measure to tell me how long the barrels are. So feel is what you should go with. In skeet, obviously, 30 inch is very popular. When I started shooting, 26 inch was very, very popular. So now 28 or 30 inch.